hello guys welcome back to the voice updates your youtube channel for entertainment politics viral videos and more so guys uh this is a wordpress conference that was uh, organized by david Adeleke, popularly known as david o. yes uh, david o and his crew uh, actually came up with a brief conference in lagos today ahead of uh, its show coming up um, on 23 of April 2023 at the Tafawa Balego Square in Lagos State, one of the biggest uh, showground in Lagos State. Or um, believe me, this is going to be an amazing concept and uh, one of the biggest show in uh, West Africa, says uh, David o, the superstar. Yes, uh, you guys know uh, David o released his, his newly awaiting album called Timeless March 21st, March 31st, 2023. This is actually uh, his fourth album. And this album and this album has uh, performed uh, wonderfully well since its release. After a long time away from the scene, David o has uh, actually came back to give his fans an unforgettable experience. At the press conference, David o actually uh, talked uh, more about his new album, his plans for the TBS show in Lagos State. David o was uh, also interviewed by many of the press. He, he answered a lot of questions from his fans and also described how his uh, Lagos show is going to look like and what his fans will be expecting from him. Yes, uh, David o, uh, first performed his song of the new album in New York and London and uh, this time around David o is set to perform his new album for the first time in Nigeria at Tafawa Balego Square in Lagos State April 23, 2023. This square is regarded as one of the uh, biggest West Africa uh, showground with uh, over 50,000 capacity. So guys, uh, take your time to watch this video to the end and uh, tell them what you think at the comment section and please if you are new here don't forget to hit on that subscribe button like share and comment <laughs> Where's the first mother of this? All right, distinguished. Um, stop into my music. I feel like you know, it should be divided. And at the end of the day, as a musician, yeah, I wanted to deliver a classic album with no there's emotion, but obviously not too much emotion. And if you listen to David O music over the years, from time, I've always been a happy person, whether I'm going through something or I'm not. So that side of my life, if I want to talk about it, there's time for that. But on this album, that was not what I was going for. So if that answers your question. Thank you. Next. All right. Um... Everybody's favorite artist is no other person than David Adeleke, a.k.a. Davido. Oh, wow. Okay, next on the introduction is the Chief Operating Officer of Torek Entertainment in person of Mr. Godson. Next up is the Project Manager, Mr. Shola Raji. Okay, it's working. All right, next is um, the Manager of the artist in question in person of Mr. Asa. The host, she does magic. Yes, she does magic. She's no other person than Miss Hawa Magaji. Next up is the head of finance, Mr. Christopher Okeke. I thought he's busy counting money. Next is the head of security, BK. Is BK here? Okay, without further ado, straight um, Alaja, 
before her Alaja, Adeto Roposhere, can you tell us why are we gathered here today? Good afternoon, everyone. Good afternoon. Thank you once again um, for the short um, timing, but you, you made it. We are all here just for us to assure you guys that um, TBS is a place to be. Unlike the thing that everyone is saying about security, we just want to make sure we assure everybody that TBS is actually more secure than what people think. And um, we should be rest assured that we are going to have a good time here. And a good, 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 good security. Maximum security. Everyone is aligned from the top to the bottom. That is, and that is why you are here to cover this and show it to the world, not just Nigeria or Lagos, that TBS is secure and we're going to have a very, very good time with all one. Okay, do we have the project manager here, Mr. Sholaraji? The core FM. So I want to ask, uh, I want to ask the video. So I've seen a lot of video of you when you going on stage. You know the energy, the the vibe. Now I want to ask, when you are going on stage, when you are on the staircase, then on the stage, what's on your mind? What is what do you have in mind? You know there is, you have some things in mind when you're planning for the show. There is a it's a different feeling when you are, you know of the car coming into the venue. Then when you are getting on the stage, what 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 comes to mind at that time? Um, it depends, and it depends on the kind of show. You know what I'm saying, it depends. So if it's like a wedding or like a birthday party, like we know that, you know, we're just about to have fun. But if it's like a major show, so like something like this, something like this, something like, the, you know, doing the O2s, arenas around the world, it's sometimes like 10 minutes before I get on stage, I like to, you know, have a low time, you know, to just get yourself together. Because you don't want to get there and miss a step. Because once you miss one step, you can destroy the rest of the show. So it depends on what the exact show I'm doing. You know what I'm saying? But I take every show seriously. Whether it's 100 people, whether it's 10,000 people or more. You know, every artist should deliver the same type of service every time. But definitely, like, before, like, big shows, I like to have small time to myself to, you know, gather myself stay calm and then when we get on stage talk to lion you understand good afternoon everyone my name is duke i see we're building the stage from days before you know not rush rush stage so it's going to be an amazing show i can't wait like i said we're still rehearsing a lot of artists i'm going to bring out surprises on the show as well so yeah just get ready energy 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 Good afternoon, everyone. My name is Adiyah from Pulse Nigeria. So, the video you dropped the most anticipated album in this of Afro Kids. And you shout out everything in Africa in one time. So, you can hear me? Oh, sorry. Good afternoon, everyone. So, the video you dropped the most anticipated album in this of Afro Kids. You shout out every streaming record in Africa. I like you. I like you. Where's your name? In one week. Yeah, in one week, you broke every single record in one week. So, um, You've also mentioned a deluxe that we should expect a deluxe. So my question is, where should we expect a deluxe? And we flex my soul be on the deluxe. That's number one. <laughs> and number two, number two. I mean, this 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 is fucking crazy. This is like 50k people that have fill up this place. So like you you're about to do like maybe the biggest show in West Africa right now. Yeah. And I like this guy. <laughs> I mean that speaks to yeah that speaks to your I mean who you are as the zero zero one the number one artist. On the continent. I love this guy. Yeah. yeah, so yeah, so I mean it's you, okay, let me answer the two. <laughs> so after like if you what next? I mean you've done it all, you've won it all, you've won it all, you've done it all, you've seen it all. So what should we expect after this? Um <laughs> Yeah, definitely the the, the the deluxe is going to come out. Um but funny enough, um people love all the songs, so like we're trying to just figure out how we're going to promote all the songs on the Original timeless and definitely move on to, to the deluxe, you know, definitely. And yeah, man, we're going to fill this place up, man, and it's going to be amazing, for sure. I'm going to break records, I'm going to show people that, you know, can do it easily. Yeah. Come on, please, um, two more questions and we're out of here, please, okay? Please, thank you. Now, to find out if you do go like me, too. That, um... We don't have any emergency issues, but also we have emergency people at hand to be able to take care of that. And um, just like you just said, we're good with security. Um, 
this place is actually way more secure than I think everybody's going based off um, ideas and not realities. So um, I think that's it for now. Thank you, Mr. Shola. All right. Um, I think we'll just open the floor for question. Please, if you have question, signify by raising up your hand. You introduce yourself, the media house you represent, and who you are directing your question to. Okay, sorry. Okay, um, David, you have something to say to us. Thank you guys for being here. You know what I'm saying? Gentlemen and ladies of the press and other people present. Um, main, you know, reason for, you know, us um, holding this press conference is to talk about the show, of course, to let people know, you know, you know, what they, what they should expect. Um, this is a fresh show of its kind. You know, people don't really do musical concerts in uh, TBS and those things, except shows like Experience. I mean. So this is the first time, like, an urban artist is coming to do a show here. So I felt like it was very important to, you know, give out information, you know, to people coming from far. It's going to be very, very safe. I've been in, I haven't really been hearing much, though. But, you know, just to some people's concerns about, you know, the safety, because if you look at the prices of the tickets and the tables, they range from all the way up to all the way down. So every type of David fan, you know, should be expecting, you know, to be out here. I just visited the CP. I woke up very early this morning, 9 a.m., you know, went to visit the CP. I had a meeting with the CP, and, you know, he assured me, you know, he's going to even deploy extra, extra men on that day. You know what I'm saying? But me just being here, I've come here twice already. And normally when I'm in, when I go out on the, you know, road, it's normally very, very rowdy and rough. And I've been here. And you can see behind, it's not even that many people as well. So I just really wanted to, you know, thank people for, you know, streaming the album. It's doing very, very well. People love it. And just come out and let's just celebrate. I have all the artists on the album flying down. You know, we have a lot, a lot of surprises as well. And it's going to be a fun day and it's going to be, I feel, you know, a start of musical shows at the TBS, you know, once we show them that, you know, production, safety, and, you know, everything can be executed. And it's going to be a good day. I can't wait. Thank you. Thank you. Please appreciate the man. Okay. Um, my first question goes to Elijah. Yeah. I mean, I mean, what's up with you on time? <laughs> That's one. Um, then, sorry, sorry. The second question is, I mean, then some other people feel that the the song was just too partish, that you should have put some soul, especially, I mean, we all know what happened. Like, I mean, some people feel that you should have put Bro, some soul into Just for the concert. Just for the concert, please. No, there's emotion, but obviously not too much emotion. And if you listen to the video music over the years, from time, I've always been a happy person, whether I'm going through something or I'm not. So that side of my life, if I want to talk about it, there's time for that. But on this album, that was not what I was going for. So if that answers your question, thank you. 